Two eaglets on Captiva Island died this month. Now crows trying to determine what led to the death of one of them. Wink News environmental reporter Stephanie Burns here. Stephanie, there's no official cause of death, but an early diagnosis points in one direction. We're waiting on the full necropsy results, but Crow tells me vets did find a broken blood feather and the eaglet likely died from blood loss. And a man-made poison could have contributed to the problem. Melissa McGarvey enjoys the bird's eye view she gets from the Captiva Eagle Cam. I think it's just neat to be able to have a, an eye on something in nature that you would never be able to, to see. And as someone who watched Harriet the Eagle's eaglet, E-14, pass away about a year ago in North Fort Myers. It was really hard to watch. Learning about the deaths of two Captiva eaglets this month really caught her eye. To think that... In two cameras, three eaglets in one year have this issue. To me, suggests that there's a lot of things going out there that we don't watch. How much more is this happening? E14's death was related to rat poison, and now vets at the Crow Clinic suspect it could have played a role in one of the Captiva eaglet's deaths. But we have to wait for the necropsy results to be sure. There was excessive blood, um, and so based on that observation and the broken blood feather, it was suspected that rodenticide poisoning, uh, rat poisoning, may have caused or been a part in this death. And if that's the case. Use of rodenticide um, doesn't just affect the rats and the rodents that they're trying to get. It also carries on up the food chain. And so the beautiful eagles and wonderful birds that you don't want to harm, there's the possibility that you are harming them. One suggested alternative is installing an owl box to attract natural predators. Since Crow is only able to take one of the eaglets, the clinic cannot confirm what happened to the other eaglet. And because of COVID restrictions, final necropsy results could take at least a month. Americans are more.